Hey guys, what's up? It's Coach Christine here. Um, I haven't updated my videos in a couple of days, and it's because I've traveled to Chicago for a wedding. Um, I think I mentioned that in one of my other posts. So, but I wanted to give an update because there's a couple things that went on um, that I really wanted to talk about. One of them was um, before I had tried the uh, the vanilla shadology at a summit, and they made it in a way that I wasn't really used to. So it didn't really, for me at least, give me the full true flavor and feeling of what Shadeology is. So um, I actually was able to try some again this weekend. And I tried it in the way that I normally do my Shadeology. I had some almond milk and I just put it with almond milk and a banana. And let me tell you something. It is flippin' delicious. Like, <laughs> it's, it's awesome. Like, if you have, matter of fact, there is no if. You should go up and get vanilla Shigology, without a doubt. And it was just, it was amazing. It, it tasted good. It had a good consistency to it. It was just awesome. And I can just imagine having it with so many different things, so many different ingredients. It was just, oh my God, it was awesome. So, um, vanilla Shigology, total thumbs up on it. Beachbody did a great job with it, and I'm very satisfied with the product. Um, also, in traveling, um, I've, you know, I'm doing body V, so, you know, it's a little bit of a challenge to try to find what you need. So, what I did was, um, because I'm doing body beast, yesterday, instead of, you know, doing my workout at home like I'm used to, I went to the gym, and, um, I did my weightlifting there, and I actually worked out with a friend of mine, and we worked on shoulders. Shoulders came out really good. Um, I was lifting a little bit heavier than I normally would because... At home, I have the Bowflex weight, so I'm able to adjust to, like, in-between weights. It doesn't just jump from 15 to 20. It'll, you know, from 15 to 17.5 and then to 20. <clears throat> It'll do in-between sets. So I lifted a little bit heavier than I normally would. However, it still worked out well. And uh, I got through my shoulder workout. It was great. It was awesome. And even while I'm traveling, I'm still making sure that, you know, I'm doing what it takes. I'm committing. I'm making sure that I'm eating right um, went out grocery shopping, what was it yesterday? No, the other day, two days ago, got a bunch of fruit, got a bunch of, um, you know, different, you know, proteins, stuff like that, so that way we could have it during this trip, and that way there would be no excuse for me not to eat clean and, and to do what needs to be done. So, that's, you know, always my point. If you're traveling, there's really no excuse for you to keep up with your, with your workout. Take your DVDs with you. Um, if you have Body Beast, get the Body Beast app. That really helped out a lot. Even at the gym, I was still able to get through my full body beast workout. I didn't have to be at home. But, I, you know, it, it's there's no excuses. There's no excuses for you not to get done. No excuses for you not to eat right and to do what needs to be done. There, there is no, well, I'm traveling, so I have to eat at a restaurant. No, you don't. Just go to the grocery store, pick up a few things, and prepare your food that way. There's no reason why you can't eat right. There's no reason why you can't work out while you're traveling. And I say this because if you, yes you, you watching this video, I'm calling you out. And if you're ready to do what it takes to be serious about your fitness, make sure you connect with me and we'll get you started. But if you're not serious, you need to get serious. So make sure you, you're watching this video right now. You need to be serious. And if you're serious about committing to your fitness and doing whatever it takes, Make sure you look below at the link, you connect with me on Facebook, and we'll get you started from there. As always, if you have any questions, email me, contact me, let me know. Alright? You guys have a good one, and until next time, make sure you're doing what it takes, you're pushing play, you're getting out there, and you're getting your fitness on.